Good morning, everybody. I hope everybody's having a great day, and I hope you're having a great summer, despite the heat. I know everybody is in a huge heat wave right now. Um, a lot of the other countries and the South, and I'm sure um, it's in a lot of places. It's been like 110, um, it feels like 110 outside heat index. That's what you call it. And the temperatures have been like 99, 98, and very humid. So the last couple of weeks, it's been really hot here. So I'm just going to tell you in this video, because of the heat wave, we decide what, what better way to handle a heat wave than to go to the lake. So um, this video has a little bit about us going to the lake, and it has a small little a uh, shot in there of my mom's summer table up at the lake. It is so pretty. It's so pretty. Um, I just had to video it. And um, and then it'll have more of um, me fixing up the house and doing some decorating and stuff. And it'll have a little bit about a meal, a little quick meal that you can make that's easy. It won't heat up your kitchen because uh, it's just fast, quick, simple. You won't get hot doing it. <laughs> and delicious. And it's a little update on the chicks. Um, and um, just a little bit of everything on this video. So, y'all, I hope y'all enjoy it. If you haven't subscribed, I would love for you to subscribe to my channel. It's free. You just hit subscribe and you are subscribed. It's that easy. Um, and it will help me so much if you'll do that. So subscribe, like, share, and um, just have fun watching the videos. And y'all have a great day, and we will see you next time. is the redneck version of a charcuterie board guys see it's perfect charcuterie board right here don't include my stomach in that. <laughs> <laughs> that's what happens to you after you eat the charcuterie board <laughs> it's so good here's proof <laughs> 
It's, it's, what do you do during a heat wave in Alabama? You go to the lake. That's it. And you sit in the shade. You get in the water, which is also pretty much like a bathtub, bathtub during a heat wave. Or you can fish. But anyway, you go to the lake. <laughs> She's not gonna get away from you at all. She's like, nope, nope, right, nope. Oh, that's cute. Don't learn that's Bella. Yeah. Ta-da. She looks like she's having so much fun. She does. She's having fun. Yeah. <laughs> Poor thing. <laughs> We're trying to get her cooled off. <laughs> he likes that better. Oh yeah, that's better. Yeah. Say thank you, Mr. Craig. Yeah. <laughs> thank you, Mr. Craig. She heard Craig talking about the fish getting her nipples. <laughs> She's got eight of them, so you don't want nothing to do with it. everybody um today i thought i would try to get a few pictures hung up um i've been real slow about that you know after you paint something <laughs> you hate to make a hole in the wall um but i'm gonna do it i'm gonna get brave I'm gonna put that new hole in there after i've um plastered and sanded and painted over all the old ones but it'll be okay keep telling myself it'll be okay um but at first I wanted to show you a couple of things um that I have found lately uh that I do want to hang up um I found this and I just love it it's just a piece of um architectural um We'll just call it a doolally. Yes, the technical term, architectural doolally, okay? <laughs> but anyway, I found this at a flea market. It was $13. Price tag is still on it, if you don't believe me. Um, and where I'm thinking of putting it I'm gonna to have to put my camera up a little bit more. Okay, where I'm thinking of doing it is up here. Would it that be lovely? What do y'all think? Do you think like there? Or do you think it would be cooler like up there? Maybe a little bit higher than that, but yeah. So what do y'all think? Oh, let me know in the comments. All right, so I've got that. And then I was gifted these pictures. Oh, they're huge. Um, I looked them up online. 
Um, and I found the artist and um, it's very popular. Um, but yeah, they're really cool etchings. He, he did etchings. And they're really cool etchings. They're really big pictures, as you can see. And they were gifted to me by a lovely family that was moving. The um, actual same family um, as uh, that I got the furniture, the veteran furniture from. So I'm just so grateful for them. Uh, they don't know how much they've helped us. But yeah, I want to put these guys up today. They're very heavy, but they're absolutely beautiful. I don't know if you can see them very well. Very unique and unusual. They're um, pictures of different um, architectural buildings overseas, actual squares, and it's got little people in them and everything. Um, and I think they were done in the 1800s. Um, not this particular one, <laughs> but um, this probably is a print of an etching, I would think. Um, but yeah, absolutely gorgeous. So I want to try to hang these up today. Ugh. Put it up. with this room so there you have it my first artwork <laughs> up <clears throat> on the walls two thumbs up And I have pretty flowery plates like that. I mean, I can change them out all along, but <clears throat> excuse me. For right now, should I have 
those. They're very old and they're absolutely gorgeous. But I need one more, so, which means I have to go to a flea market and go shopping and wouldn't that just be awful? I know, I know. <laughs> Not. <laughs> but yeah, so we got that look. Or we have this look. A little more summery, a little more whimsical. So, y'all tell me, which ones do you think for right now? Or, if you think none of the above, then let me know that too. Or, this one. Alright, so that's three to choose from. Tell me which one you like the best. Gorgeous day right now. The air is actually cool and not humid. So, very early in the morning, um, and I am fixing to go feed the chickens, collect the eggs, and pick some peaches from the orchard. I hope they're good. They might not be, but they look ready, so we'll see. They've about done their thing. There's a big one. And these, this is our scutman vine. <laughs> and it has just gotten huge. And it'll have the best scutmans on it you've ever tasted later on this summer. Uh, the girls are ready for me. They're pacing back and forth. <laughs> mm. Well, was, wasn't much of a blackberry harvest, but hey, <laughs> better than nothing. Uh, like I said, we've got most of the blackberries off the bush already.
see how the chicks are doing. There's Mama. Oh, and there they are. Good morning, lovelies. <laughs> Look how cute. They're all doing really well. <laughs> Mama's throwing hay all over them. Uh, I wish she would come out with them. Like she's making them a nest. <laughs> There's Spencer. Hey, Spencer. Good morning. Little Spence. <laughs> Not too many eggs this morning. I think in this heat wave, they're kind of slowing down a little bit. <laughs> And I don't blame them. Let's go up the hill. See what we can find. All the peaches might be off the trees. The peach trees are still real small. And they're putting off really small naughty peaches. Aha! Check it out! Oh, they feel good. They feel good and soft and tender. Ooh, this tree's got a lot. Wow. Look at all the beauties on there. Yep, I feel ready. Oh, that's still a little bit. Hard, 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 hard. All right, we're gonna let these sit a couple more days. That one was ready. Okay, we do have some peppers ready. This is the cutest little pepper bush I've ever seen. I mean, they're just tiny. Yes, I do need to weed my garden. <laughs> it is a weedy mess. Ooh. Lots of tomatoes.
yum. Mm, look at these. Mm. This is my lovely potato crop. Well, part of it. Um, I've already used a bunch, so. Um, I have a few left, and tonight I'm just going to make um, a little potato dish. All you do is boil your potatoes, and then you can put, you can split them open, and put butter and you put cheese on them, whatever you want, sour cream, and anyway, yeah. So it's just gonna be simple, quick, and I'm gonna use the potatoes that I grew in my garden. get a blanket and all it is is mayonnaise mustard and honey and you just dump it in and stir it all together taste it and if you think it needs more mayonnaise more honey or more mustard you add it until you get it like you like it it's so easy and it's so delicious Yum! These potatoes, to die for, already tasted them. <laughs> they are so yummy. So we got baked beans, the potatoes, the dip, and the pig in a blanket. Yummy, yummy. Let's eat!